Hello everyone. Today I'll show you how to use virtual emulator in Android Studio if you have an AMD based PC. When you use x86 based Android emulators in Android Studio, you might get an error popping up, Intel HAXM is required or your system does not support VTX. After looking for solution in Google, I found that ARM based Android emulator might fix this problem. A few moments later. This fix still loading after 5 minutes. Let find a fast and proper solution. We'll use Nox Player as an Android emulator. Download the Nox Player from the link in the video description. I already downloaded it, so I'm cancelling the download. Now install the Nox player. It is very simple, just follow the instruction. Installation is complete, now start the app from desktop shortcut. At first you need to enable root in the player settings. Then restart the Nox player. A quick tip. If you are getting performance issue in Nox player, 
make sure Hyper-V is disabled and virtualization is enabled in BIOS settings. Now you need to unlock developer option to enable USB debugging. Click on build number 7 times to unlock developer options. Sorry, the click was bugged out in the video. Now enable USB debugging from developer options. Open command prompt and change the location to bin folder of Nox installation directory. Execute the following command and close the command prompt. Now you can use Nox Player as a virtual emulator in Android Studio. Android is compiling the APK, wait until it's done. You can also increase the RAM and CPU cores from settings. You can view the APK in both phone and tablet mode also in different resolution. Restart to apply the new settings. Like the video and share it with your friends. Hit the subscribe button for more tutorials in future. Thanks for watching the video and have a nice day.